we have no income. We have nothing coming in at all. Right. Disability is basically non-existent right now. On August 30th, Calvin Lang suffered a stroke in his home in Englewood, New Jersey. Calvin was the pillar in his community, a youth mentor, a basketball coach, a referee. He even received a prestigious award from the General Assembly of the State of New Jersey in acknowledgement of his extraordinary work in the community and for the community. He's been a community leader all of his life and now he's going through a really tough time. With almost $50,000 worth of medical bills that he needs to pay back, he's struggling to put food on the table for his family. I've been paying our bills on my credit card. Okay. Um, I, I, I've been keeping us afloat and for now. And how much longer do you think you can continue? Not, Not much, much longer, longer. because <laughs> once credit cards are maxed out, then that's it. In addition to their looming medical bills, Calvin is about to lose his medical insurance. It's possibly going to get dropped because we can't pay it. How long do you have before that happens? Probably. It's past. It's past. It's past due. She, the, the lady at the hospital is just holding out, okay. I think, for us for as long as she can. But that's due. He has to have his medical. Now, their extended family hasn't been able to help, whether that's financial or they're just not in the area. I'm not sure. but. There's nobody there to really help them out, but they have a great friend who reached out to us and that's how we heard about this story and she just wanted to help her friends out. I knew things were bad, I just didn't know how bad and to find out they're not receiving disabil a disability check, they have no income, she has five children and now she has a disabled husband. So. They really need the public support. Thanks to a local community organization, Calvin and Teresa were able to have a great Thanksgiving dinner with their family just this past Thursday. They had the full table set out. They got to enjoy the meal with their kids. And guess what? Three of their girls actually got to play in the Philadelphia Thanksgiving Day Parade. They were just really excited. So they made it a positive situation at a really sad time, but we need to help them out. So I'm gonna put the GoFundMe link on my Facebook and my Instagram. So if you guys can help out, that would be great. How much of a hole are they in, Adian? They have $50,000 worth of medical bills that they need to pay, and right now they can't pay for their regular household bills. Ariane, what, uh, what state of mind are the kids in now? Because you said they were performing at the Philadelphia Parade, like how are they now? These kids are happy kids. They're just normal, hardworking too. But are, are they worried about their parents? I'm sure that they are, but like any child, these people are really hardworking individuals. Their oldest child has like three different jobs. Work ethic is not a problem in this family. Yeah, let's hope they can get through this month and from there pay their medical bills and maintain themselves. So thank you for the story.